50 years, and no one's ever escaped from New Folsom. But we broke it open in an afternoon. Mobius wants us to go after another artifact on some dead world called Zill. Apparently, they sent in a specialist team, but they lost contact with them two days ago. They're bad luck, I guess. Figure we'll get hazard pay for this one. So here's the deal. This place is a morgue. Whatever used to live in these ruins up and died millions of years ago. Before they went missing, the Mobius team reported artifact radiation emanating from that big old hunk of rock over yonder. They brought a big damn laser drill to burn the way in. Laser drill? That thing's a monster. If the Mobius team had access to that kind of hardware, I need to think about what could have wiped them out. Reckon we'll find out soon enough, partner. Watch your corners, boys. We don't know who cleaned this place out. More Terran beings. The mysteries of this place are forbidden. You will pay for your transgressions with your lives. Okay. At least we know what happened to the other expedition. Armed and ready. Mobius Space Local Net accessed. Decrypting security overrides. Transferring control of base structures to you, Commander. Fire it up. 174 gigawatts. The power of the sun at your fingertips. Now get it aimed at that door and let's get cutting. Laser output is good. Drilling will take some time, but there's no other way into the temple. Sir, the Taldarim are mobilizing their forces against us. So we set a perimeter and protect the drill until we're through. I'm just glad we've got siege tanks. Sir, I've managed to access what's left of the Mobius Expedition sensor net. I'll route it through your map so you can see what the Taldarim are up to. You would desecrate that which belongs to the gods. This will not be born by the faithful. Sir, those are Protoss Archons. If they get too close, our men won't stand a chance. I'm giving you manual control of the laser drill. See if you can use it against the Protoss. All right, you heard the man. Swing that laser around. We can use it to drive back the Protoss. The laser drill has breached the door's outer layer. Alert! Enemy air units will approach vector. Dead air units. Nothing. Those are transports. Use the laser to knock them down fast. The laser drill is now cutting through the door's thermal barrier. Sir, more air units inbound. We gotta take them out, or they'll keep dropping troops right on top of them. Thermal barrier breached. The laser drill is now cutting through the core. They seek to befoul the legacy of the gods. Destroy them. Breach of the doorway core is imminent. Structure access imminent. It is our sacred duty to stop these defilers. Burn them to ashes. You have prevailed. For now, word of this sacrilege will echo across the stars, James Raynor. The day of reckoning draws near. These artifacts of yours seem real popular, Tychus. What do we care? As long as the pay's good. Really? I'd say getting vaporized by the Taldarim definitely counts as diminishing returns.
Raider. I bring tidings of doom. Zeratul. I have pierced the veil of the future and beheld only oblivion. Yet one spark of hope remains. You will hold her life in your hands. And though justice demands that she die for her crimes, only she can save us. Wait a second. You're talking about Kerrigan. It's been four years. You show up out of nowhere. Time is oh. short. You must understand. The answers you seek lie within. Study it well. The fate of creation hangs in the balance. Nice to see you too. I've heard of these Ehon crystals before. Supposedly they allow you to relive another person's memories. Zara Tools uncovered. He was desperate for me to see it too. Well, here goes nothing. Raynor, the hounds of the void are closing in. I impart my memory, my very essence, into this Ehan crystal, so that you will see what I have seen, and that the future may yet have hope. I see we have a new acquisition. Is it a Protoss device? That's right. But I wouldn't mess with it if I were you. It's a Kaderan Ehan crystal. It's a memory storage device. It lets you experience what other people have seen or done. It can be dangerous if you don't know what you're doing. Yet you don't fear it at all. You're a fascinating man, Jim Rayner. You know more about the Protoss and the Zerg than any of the experts I've read about. Holding these artifacts is making me nervous. Can you tell me any more about them? It's interesting. The one from Zill is different than the others. However, I think all of them once constituted a single device. You mean they make something bigger? It would seem so. It's just a theory, but there's an attraction between the artifacts we've collected. A kind of harmonic resonance. Given the points of contiguous translinear alignment, I think they'd be drawn together like magnets under the right field adjustment. Okay. Well, don't adjust anything just yet, Doc. I like them aligned just the way they are. Had any visitors lately? I don't know what you're talking about, Tosh. Oh, I think you do, James Rayner. Something was on this ship just now. I still smell it on you. Protoss. Interesting. Whatever you think you know, you just keep it to yourself. I hear you yapping about this, and I'll toss you out the airlock. So now we've got three of these artifacts on my ship. When are we supposed to hand these damn things over? Well, that's gonna be a bit tricky. I hear the Zerg have attacked the Mobius Research Center on Tirador. I don't get it, though. What's the Queen of Blades after? Ain't no artifacts there. If those eggheads can't hold out till we get there, we may never know. Upload the data to the star map. Looks like we got ourselves a good old-fashioned rescue mission. This is Donnie Vermillion, live from UNN. Tonight, the Zerg invasion. The battle so far. The Terran Dominion is holding firm under Zerg aggression. Our industrial complex has stepped up production on all fronts. Enlistment rates have risen within the penal system, and the Marine Corps is ready to get in the fight. The Zerg won't know what hit them. Donnie, has there been any word on when we start pushing the aliens back? Kate, if I revealed that, I'd be giving away vital Dominion secrets. You think the Zerg watch our broadcast? I know they do, Kate. I know they do. Well, you heard it here first, folks. This is Kate Lockwell for UNN. We're rocking some serious heavy metal now that we got siege tanks. Yes, sir. The comforting thunder of the big guns. Well, comforting when they're on our side. Yeah, these newer tanks have better guns when they're on the move. And reinforced armor. So long as they still got the range in siege mode, the rest is just gravy. Between siege tanks and bunkers, 
We can hold the line against just about anything. You ain't gonna believe this, but I just saw Zeratul on the ship. Uh, how much did you have to drink tonight, sir? He was here, Matt. And he was hurt. On the run from something. Where is he now, sir? I don't know. But he ain't on the ship anymore. He gave me an Eon memory crystal, and he was desperate for me to study it. I guess he wants me to see what he's seen. <laughs>